I right, just wanted to add a few things about the um, tank repair. Um, obviously, these tanks are made out of tissue paper. You, um, if you're going to attempt any sort of welding repair, when you're cleaning back, don't hang about too much with the grinder. If you get, see, like I've got to grind this weld off. I've just done here. You need to. I use a. Um, a sanding pad rather than going at it with a grinding wheel because if you touch the material around the outside um, two seconds it's so bloody thin you'll never weld it up you'll have to cut it out and patch it so we're just when you're sanding back just make sure that you sand off your weld and um, don't hang about too much off the edge on the parent material because within two seconds it's so thin that it might look like it's welded but it's so thin it's going to rot away. Now the, the idea of coating it in that sealant is tanks are coated on the inside with an anti-rust if you just leave it as bare metal because obviously you can't get in there and paint it with a spray can um, it will just the pet the, the water in the petrol will just rot it away and it won't last five seconds. Um, I can't get my hand on that sealant because it's over in the pile, the pile of new parts, which um, <laughs> one day will fit. That's the new exhaust pipes. Up there. That's the new tail pipes that came the other day. Funky. Um, it's getting exciting now. Uh, my mate's doing the exhaust pipe. We came around the other day with the first um, section, do a test fit. Um, hopefully, by the end of next week, we'll have a we'll have the exhaust here to um, bolt on and measure up where this goes. So now this this the original CX pipes pipes are quite tiny, 35 mil. So if you buy any exhaust pipes you need to make sure inside that bag there there's a, a step down reducer you, you slide it on you cut it this goes right down to 28 mil you see the size difference you, so whatever exhaust you have made or using you can cut this to the right size and then get it TIG welded on and I'm thinking of changing Ooh. This is uh, an old welder I've had for a thousand years, which is just about at it. And a plasma cutter, which I use for doing some artwork. But that plasma cutter was 135 quid. For an extra 50 quid, you can get a plasma cutter with a TIG welder on, which runs, if you've got the right gas for your MIG, it will run your TIG as well. So things like this fuel tank, which I'm doing with a MIG, would be ideal, would do it with a TIG, TIG welder. Um, it wouldn't blow through so much because you've got much more control like if you were gas welding so um, just bear that in mind that if you're doing these repairs if you if you don't know what you're doing before you know it you can grind away too much and you'll end up having to take it to a shop to get it done professionally anyway because I am a professional <laughs> the other thing you're doing if you're doing your own jobs get yourself one of these Reactor light masks. I think I bought this one the other day because the one I had when I got out of the army, I bought when I was a welder in Civil Street. Um, cost me about 135 quid, but that was about a thousand years ago. Now that that mask there, I bought that the other day, 17 pound free postage. It's just not worth struggling with old useless flipping kit in this day and age. So. Um, yeah, one of the best buys you can do is one of those reactor like masks um, for your welding. Okay, sorry to moan on a bit, but um, I wouldn't want you to bugger these tanks up. They're so thin. When they, sh when they go through the press, it stretches them so thin, especially around on the corners here. So I just have to repair that one again. And um, it's difficult. My, my workshop's about the darkest place you can be, and it is the windiest day on earth, all the wind blowing, the noise of the machine, darkness. The, once you put a whizzer filler over the top of that, that'll, that'll all be gone.
you know. Now, I know a lot of people like their tanks. Boy over the road, it's just lacquer it. This is the in thing to have it metal, but you can't if you've got to fill this. There's lots of dents where it was done, filled before. It's, it's an old tank. Okay, bye.